And now to the race for the White House as former President Trump faces criticism from his supporters in Congress after traveling with a 9-11 conspiracy theorist. Meanwhile, VP Harris is focusing on one of the biggest battleground states in the East. RDC Bureau Chief Ben, ben Kennedy has more. Good evening, Pennsylvania! Vice President Kamala Harris in battleground Pennsylvania Friday night. And as president, I will make sure... It's a state that Trump won in 2016 but lost to Biden in 2020 by about 1%. The Democratic nominee met with voters in Republican areas in an effort to secure their support in 2024. As Harris called out what she says is divisive rhetoric by former President Donald Trump. It just stops with all the trying to divide us. Like, people are exhausted with that stuff. <laughs> Exhausted. Meanwhile, her GOP rival held a campaign rally in Las Vegas. A new Reuters Ipsos poll shows Harris leading Trump among registered voters by 5%, outside the margin of error. Earlier in the day, the former commander chief held a news conference at his golf resort in California. It's there he faced questions on a woman who has been traveling with him named Laura Loomer, a far-right activist and a 9-11 conspiracy theorist who has posted racist language about Harris, with some of Trump's allies now asking him to distance himself from her. Laura is a supporter. Uh, I don't control Laura. Laura has to say what she wants. She's a, she's a free spirit. Now, Trump will be in North Carolina in Michigan next week while Harris returns to Battleground, Pennsylvania. It is a state that she says she's feeling good about. In Washington, D.C., Ben Kennedy, Local 10 News.